What is up guys and welcome back to another Raid Shadow Legends video with me The Real Deal. So today we've got 200 mortal soul stones to pull. I've been saving up these bad boys for two months which is just crazy um, but I'm hoping we get something good today. We'll just have to wait and see. Um, so I'm an end game free to play player. Where do I get my soul stones from? Well Hydra is a really good place so I do normal hard and brutal um, tournaments. So any sort of events or tournaments where I see soul stones or soul essences or these like coins you can get anything that relates to ascension i'm going for it um and then the other place is iron twin stage 15 so do that every day and then sundays i, I put in gems to get those extra keys as well because sunday you can get an extra bonus so you get double the amount of uh, rewards which is really good so of course do that as well um so yeah that's pretty much soul stones but just before we start pulling i do want to say thank you so much guys I'm so close to hitting my uh, target of 300 subs. So a big thank you to you guys. And if you are new to the channel, please do subscribe because it helps my channel grow and it motivates me to make more content for you guys. So thank you so much for your love and support. I really do appreciate it. So let's uh, start pulling some mortal soul stones. So we've got uh, 200 to go. So I'm really hoping we get something good. So many champions that I'd really like. Um, okay, nothing. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, Helicaf, great champion. Tomb Lord, I don't have, but I will definitely say both of those. Helicaf, definitely, um, I've not actually leveled or um, ascended mine yet, but great champion. I think I've got two actually, but um, is it a she or a he? It's a he. Um, Helicaf is a great champion, definitely worth investing in. Uh, probably put Brimstone on them for more damage, but it depends where, I, where I'm going to play with them. Golden Reaper, great champion for Arena. N more gold S uh, Sathelia another one oh my god Kandra for uh, three that um the luck is insane today my friends I wish my shards were like this so Sigmund great for Hydra um I've got mine leveled up but I've not really geared him yet so I've not really used him but I know he's really good for Hydra Kandra Fon, one of my most wanted champions definitely be holding to a uh, Sathelia I've got her as well she is great uh, she strips she heals um, great for arena, defense, offense, and great for Hydra as well. So great champion. Great for all PvE content, to be fair. So not I don't feel like we're going to be as lucky. Mordecai, another great champion. Great for Spider. HP Burn Master. Um, and great for Hydra as well, actually. Fenex, great champion. Um, can use him for Ice Golem on his uh, A1. He blocks Revive. Uh, Lua, I've never used her, but I know she hits like a truck, so she's a great choice as well. Getting some really, really good pulls right now. Like, this is just crazy. Definitely seems like worth holding. Oh, here we go again. Fushan. All right, I think I think my Fushan's already at four plus, so I'm going to have to get a refund on that. Skull Crown, another great champion. Five star. Um, definitely going to be... Uh, invested into her even though she's been a bit power crept these days she's not as strong as she used to be she is still a solid champion especially for arena okay anyone else no i mean bella was decent um i'd oh here we go again oh hepa frick or hepa freak hepa frock I, I i just can't pronounce it Oh my god, how many is that? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six star for a champion I don't have. And I want this guy so bad. He is like the king of arena right now. He is just dry. <laughs> Sorry. <coughs> Sorry, I've uh I'm just recovering from COVID, so I've still got a bit of a cough. Um Hepafrek is an absolute beast in the arena. He is dropping people left, right, and center. And um, basically, whenever one of your colleagues or, or <laughs> teammates dies, basically, um, he gets like a second hit and he'll just counter attack and he's just absolute beast. Uh, Relicary Tender is a great champion. Here we go again. Oh, Ragash, I don't have. Um, I didn't go for that fusion. Um, but yeah, definitely a solid champion as well. Really good. Rock Tooth is great as well. Um, really good for like early mid game for Spirit. Keep if you want to farm potions because he puts out a block. Um, no, uh, reduced healing by 100%. And Relicary Tender as well is a great champion. Um, I think. She has Revive and Cleanse. One of the few rares that does that. 
Uh, Sky Touch Shaman, great champion. I use it all the time in Arena. Great counter. Oh, here we go again. Creela, I don't have. Um, I think she's actually one of the worst Legos. And again, who we got now? Oh, um, <laughs> Hacker Kron. Um, I can't even pronounce his name. Hacker on. He is also a solid champion. Um, great for arena defense. He cleanses. And I also believe that he um, has ally attack as well. So I just need to make some space. And we're back. All right. 120 to go. Let's see if we if the luck continues. Um, I'll be honest. Like, this is just crazy. Like, I just love it. Um, I wish my shard pools were like this. Just mental. Okay. All trash apart from Kale. Um, like, Kale is just such an awesome champion. Um, you know, he can silo Minotaur. Um, he's great for... Here we go, here we go. Xavier, another champion I don't have. Um, but yeah, Kale, he's a great champion. He can even, like, use him in secret rooms and stuff. Especially, like, on Rotation 2, where there's some really hard ones. Um... Yeah, none here that I'd keep apart from um, Abyssal. So you can use them for a secret room on the hard stages. Um, so just like a very niche one to hold on to. Here we go, here we go. Oh, Acrecia, I don't have. Um, an amazing champion for Hydra. Side of my clan actually has two. And he is just wrecking um, Hydra, Brutal and Nightmare right now with those guys. Is it a guy? I think it's a girl actually. Uh, yes, yeah, chick. I, can, I see a bit of slight side boob. Um, all right, let's keep going. Oh. Oh, Astrolyph. Astrolyph, Astrolyph, Astrolyph. I love Astrolyph. She is so underrated. She is great for Arena. Um, I have like a bomb comp that I use her with. And basically, um, her bombs can't be resisted. So there'll be like a Duchess with crazy, crazy resistance. And your bombs are just going and just drop her. I'm great for Bommel as well. I actually use her in my um, hard level 90 or floor 90 Bommel team comp. And she just drops that as well. Necred, an insane champion. Um, really want him. Whenever I see him in arena defense, I'm always a bit uh, always a bit reluctant to going on that team. But yeah, he is an absolute boss. So much protection from him. Uh, Magna, great champion. Yeah. Yeah, he's the only one that's pretty decent out of these lot. But Magna, great champion. Um, great for Arena and just, uh, yeah, you can use him using Bommel as well, actually. But um, yeah, let me just make some more space. And we're down to our last 60. Let's go. Um, I'm, I would actually like some uh, some legendary pools for some champions that I actually do have, though. That would be nice. Don't feel like I'm asking for too much. Okay. Uh, Duh is actually an awesome champion. Um, I don't know if if she's underrated, but um, I use her in one of my Iron Twins team. Um, she's great. Uh, Dudan is a great champion as well. Um, he's one of the new champions, and he has a he has taunt. Here we go. Here we go. Another Sigmund. Oh, I think they're desperate for me to uh, to actually start using him in Hydra. That's what they're telling me. Okay, Dirk is okay. I'd say he's like sort of average. Don't really use him. Armina, no good at all. Do not use it at all. Oh, I think we've got 40 to go. Come on. Like a Valkyrie would be nice. I've got three of those. Um, Arbiter would be another great one. Hegemon, I'd love that. I'm not feeling it, guys. I am not feeling it. Started strong, and I think this is our last 10, and we're going to finish probably quite weak. Oh, okay, so I think this is our last 10, maybe. Rockbreaker is a great champion. Nalhan's great as well. Um, both provoke champions. Rockbreaker can be used for uh, faction wars. Here we go, here we go. Oh... Galicia, she is a good champion. Um, I don't use her though. Um, I know I've seen some uh, unorthodox uh, team comps with her in a re a tag arena. And they are pretty solid to be fair. But yeah, that's all of them. So who have I got that can actually wake? Uh, like just... So yeah, Sigmund Sethia. Uh, Sethia. Sethalia. 
God, if I can actually speak today. Um, yeah, so Astrolyph is going to be definitely getting empowered. And Gembo is one of my favorite champions as well. So good to empower him. And also um, my Skull Crown as well. So that is the end of the video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please leave me a cheeky thumbs up. Make sure you smash, smash, smash that subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video. Peace.